I was born uh, near Paris uh, and I've always lived uh, either in the suburbs with my parents and my sister. Yeah, I grew up like in a, you know, in a house uh, with garden, you know, normal neighborhood. Maxime Vachelegraaf was introduced to chess when he was just five years old. My father taught me the rules and basically everyone in the family started playing for for a year or two, but then, uh, then it was all, all me. <laughs> At six years old, after only one year of playing the game, he showed signs of being an exceptional chess talent. I won uh, my first uh, French championship under eight that year. Say Paris, Rapid and Blitz. And then I continued playing, continued winning this youth events. Uh, when I started getting medals also uh, uh, with uh, competitors from all over the world, it was clear I had the chance to, to go further. I have pretty good intuition. I'm very resilient, uh, normally speaking. So I always try to create some trouble uh, for my opponents where, when I'm in a bad shape. Then I'm very good at spotting uh, quick tactics. Besides from being a top 10 chess player, Maxime has been able to study and get a degree in mathematics. This way I could socialize, I could um, keep on getting, having a life outside uh, the chessboard and it also felt more secure to have uh, a degree to rely on uh, should I stop uh, playing chess. Well, I've loved playing chess from the start, so for me it's all about the, the game, so the playing part, so I, I'm not so fond of studying and uh, of course it's necessary, but uh, what I like is playing games, uh, having fun, you know, even playing a blitz game, being able to trash talk a bit, uh, to, you know, be very casual and then of course uh, competitive part where you know I, I want to win the game I want to to be the best uh, player I can be and to, to beat uh, to beat everyone basically.